What's up guys tech buddy here, and welcome to a brand new video on the channel in today's video I'm going to be showing you top 3 most dangerous hackers of all time. There are good and bad hackers. Here is a window into what they do, and why. White hat hackers, these are the good guys, computer security experts who specialize in penetration testing, and other methodologies to ensure, that a company's information systems are secure. These IT security professionals rely on a constantly evolving arsenal of technology to battle hackers. Black hat hackers, these are the bad guys, who are typically referred to as just plain hackers. The term is often used specifically for hackers who break into networks or computers, or create computer viruses. Hacking purists often use the term crackers, to refer to black hat hackers. Black hat's motivation is generally to get paid and there are many notable hackers around the world. We at Hacked have put together a list of the top 3 most dangerous hackers of all time. At number 3. Gary McKinnon. Between 2001 and 2002, Scottish computer hacker Gary McKinnon gained access to 97 American military networks between 2001 and 2002, even leaving the military a message on its website, your security is crap. McKinnon's goal was to prove the existence of UFOs. The US failed to extradite him. His hack has been called the biggest military computer hack of all time. Today the former hacker has reinvented himself as a seer wizard, charging £40 per hour to help firms rank. Here is what the well-known hacker said he found during his hacks. At number 2, James Coster and partners hacked big business and military computers, including major banks, General Electric and IBM. He was 14 year old. Convicted of 45 counts of technical burglary and 45 years in prison, he instead joined the Navy at 18 years old as intelligence analyst. At 20 he joined the CIA to track warlords in Africa and Middle East, and at 24 he sold his first dot-com company for millions of dollars. Today he mentors troubled youth to tap their full potential. When you look a little deeper, as people did with me, you're able to get kids focused on their potential, he once said. Here is a recent TED talk he gave on the online gambling. And finally number 1, Jonathan James known as Comrade by many online. 15-year-old Jonathan James was the first juvenile convicted and jailed in the United States for hacking. James hacked into companies like Bell South, as well as the Miami-Dade school system and the Department of Defense in 1999. He gained access to information like the source code responsible for operating the International Space Station. Once NASA detected the breach, the space agency shut down their computers for three weeks, apparently losing an estimated $41,000. Arrested on January 26. 2000, James plea bargained and was sentenced to house arrest and probation. He later served six months in an Alabama prison, after failing a drug test, and thus violating his probation. Boston Market, Barnes & Noble, Office Maximum and other companies were victims of a 2007 massive hack. James was investigated by law enforcement for the crimes despite his denying any involvement. James was found dead from a self-inflicted gunshot, wound on May 18, 2008. In his suicide note he wrote he was troubled by the justice system, and believed he would be prosecuted for newer crimes with which he had nothing to do. Finally we came to the end, if you guys like this video hit that like button, and also subscribe to our channel, to keep receiving more tips tricks as always thanks for watching my video. And I'm signing out.